Hey guys, my name is Mike McCarvel, and we are on to, this is episode 107. Uh, we are going to do Quartz Hill Mine, kit number 221. Good instructions, and um, this is just time to kind of complement it so you can get a little bit better views of some of the things that uh, we're going to do. Now, um, this kit has a uh, enclosed head frame, the piece that actually gets the mine shaft uh, equipment up and down in the the ore out so uh, one of the things I did is I actually put this on a thick base so that I could uh, cut out the mine shaft below and uh, kind of give a starter to the uh, to the shaft um, and since it's got an enclosed head frame um, I decided to add a mine hoist to this I took this out of the builders and scale kit number 609 mine hoist and ore skip the ore skip won't fit so we could only use the mine hoist, but the ore skip we can add as scenery detail. So, um, if you have any questions about the basic build steps, um, I'm not going to repeat that because it'd be very repetitive to the last two videos: the Druid mine and the Federal mine. Go check those out, um, 106 and 105. And um, I'm going to put notes in the uh, text for this video as well, so we're not going to go over that either. But I did want to just mention that. Um, other than the uh, interior head frame and the smoke jacks, um, this kit has a uh, corrugated material, which is actually kind of a paper material, and it makes putting the corrugated metal um, roofing much easier than the uh, metallic type foil. So it doesn't chip. Uh, it you really have to go out of your way to kind of. Uh, scrape the uh, paint off of it so it's a lot more forgiving than the uh, metal foil on some of the kits so um, I've kind of grown to really enjoy uh, putting these one before I would just kind of dread it so anyway this video is the rest of this is just going to be a quick walk around of um, each of the angles I'm going to show the interior of it and the mine winch and then um, underneath uh, what the base looks like it was a three-quarter inch piece of pine and it got uh, drilled that out and then carved it out with a exacto blade to a little rough so it looks like it's uh, rock surfaces and that's it so um, I just wanted to make this as a uh, complement to the instructions so let's go ahead and get started and I'll show you the pictures of the uh, finished product thanks guys <music> 